So Donnie Jones is our install foreman, the crew chief. Donnie is an incredible asset to our company. He has a couple of decades of experience in the construction industry. Dario, Eight. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Let's hook up uh, that compressor over there and see if we got the hose. You should have seen me by the time I was eating my ice cream. I was like. <laughs> Excessive, we'll be working for excessive. We'll be working for Paul Nelson, not me. <laughs> I know. So if I wake up, I'm over. Yeah. Donnie is great with the crew. How to motivate those guys. He's got this incredible sense of humor. Coming into a new construction setting with a brand new school being built, there's hundreds of other people on that job. And so sometimes it's a negotiation just to get people out of the way so that we can start work. Donnie's gotten good at that. He's now put in a couple hundred floors for us, so he's also bringing that specific experience to the job. He understands just the range of challenges that could face an install crew every day, and he's gotten really good at problem solving. Were nails getting like bent up and jammed? That's driven, I don't know, 250,000 nails, and I can't find any sign of wear on it. I need the parts. I came in here and bought them out of demo blades the other day. Elvis was a hero to most white folks, but he didn't mean shit to me. Here we are, bearing gifts. Yes, I really needed you over there a long time ago. Long time. I forgot to take out the piece that you took me in the morning. It's all documented. Yeah, you can yeah. watch it on uh, your favorite. Not me. Hey, Paul. This is what you're hearing. Kevin James Featherary. Top dog. Top. He runs the show. I just I just act like I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Endeavor to persevere. <laughs> so that's what you gotta do. You gotta endeavor to persevere. Oh yeah. Before we get you rolling, we're gonna we're gonna adjust the pressure on that compressor. Okay. It requires more air. I'll be patient. Don't kill my compressor. No. Nope. I've been the athletic director full time since last June. I mainly have coached in the past know full well how important a new gym floor is. The building opened in October of 1969, so it's a 50 it was a 50-year-old floor. The progress that has transpired so far is just remarkable. We're very excited. The coaches, the players, anybody that uses the floor now, we, we host high school basketball games. There's lots of other events that go on, but I know that everybody is really looking forward to getting out on the new court. The only thing you need to do is remove the tongue. Move the tongue from here. That's what I said. I just don't see you ever. 